Hello everyone, I hope you are all having a wonderful day. So this is going to be general reading for everyone under the zodiac sign of Taurus for the month of September. So let's see what is important to know for you for the month of September, what will help you, the guidance for Taurus. This tarot card reading is for everyone under the zodiac sign of Taurus. Please allow me to see what is important to know for them. I'm going to receive for Taurus. Taurus, September. What is important to know for you? Oh my goodness. Taurus, September. What is important to know for them? Okay, I will cut the deck and I begin pulling the cards. Okay, when it comes to love, what is important to know for Taurus? When it comes to love, what is important to know for everyone? I know the solid sign of Taurus. I'm going to receive love. What is coming? What is important to bring to the surface? Okay, we have expressed your love. Okay, we have soulmate. Okay, so Taurus, um, the first thing I began seeing for you is that um, in the past, um, this can be the past three weeks, there has been situations uh, in your life or in your home and in the things that you are doing, okay? This is more related to um, your work, you plans, ideas, and your finances. I see that if some of you when were looking for a job, you had been hired. If you um, apply to, to new jobs or schools or anything that you have in mind as projects and ideas, uh, I just see a yes, okay? Either you had been called for an interview or this is also indicating me that um, if you're trying to bring any idea, plan, or aspiration for the future, you are not alone. You have collaboration, and, and this is indicating to me that many of you, Taurus, are moving things forward. This is when it comes to plans, ideas, finances, education, anything that you had uh, put in your mind uh, for the future. Okay, so this is really, this is looking to me really good because this is not just thinking that you are going to be doing something. This is actually putting in the action to begin moving forwards in the right direction for you. Okay, so there is the action, there is the the idea, there is the input, there is the yes, and many and many um, situations in your life that I see for you in the in the month of August. The are moving forward okay this is also indicating to me that uh, because things are working out better for you uh, in your finances and things moving forward that you are not as worried and preoccupied maybe as how you had been in the previous months this is because of the pandemic now you are working you have collaboration maybe this is also telling me that uh, you might begin learning something new and that is um, moving forward in the right right direction okay this is um this is a little more different now we we talk about uh, plants and ideas when it comes to studies or anything else now this is more in clarity okay this can be clarity about uh, in your relationships or a situation okay so for example if you thought that someone lied to you um, you find out that that person didn't lie to you if you were thinking that someone was hiding something from you, this is having clarity, okay, about either if that person did lie to you or not. And um, having that clarity allows you to begin moving forward with better um, either plans for the future or more in you, in the right feelings, okay? Because if you think 
did this person like hide something from you? Did this person cheated on me? Did this person lie to me? Is this person hiding? It's like you not you moving forward in life, but you don't have clarity. Okay, I see the clarity either came at the end of August or you are about to receive that clarity for the month of September. For many of you, okay, Taurus, something is happening maybe in your relationships, in your relationships uh, and in life situations. This is indicating to me many of you, Taurus, um, are or will be single women in the month of September. This is also indicating to me, okay, if you are a single woman or you will be a single woman in the month of September, please um, don't worry. I see you have everything you are going to need to support yourself. This is indicating to me, don't worry, you are a hardworking woman. You know how to do things. You know how to resolve. And you are going to be standing in your ground uh, very strongly in the month of August. This is indicating to me, okay, even though... Even know when you feel that you are not doing anything to resolve or you are not uh, moving things forward, this is indicating to me that is not the case. You are actually moving forward um, regardless if you are not seeing the progress um, happening for you back to back. Okay? Why? because it's different different areas in your life that you have to resolve okay first i see the finances second of all i see emotionally emotionally this is a uh, very strong and very different for some of you why because i see many of you are going to have the realization or the understanding from the inside out, that either a relationship doesn't make you happy anymore, that you have to remove yourself, that something has changed, even though you might continue resolving in the first days of August, okay? But this resolving is issues that I see that can be in the relationship that um, you're resolving for for now, but that resolving is not um, the resolving that is needed, okay? It's like when you say, okay, you know what? I don't want to argue anymore. Let's just make peace for now and continue life, okay? That is the kind of resolving that I see, not talking about the issues, not making them bigger, um, but the linger of the issue is still there, okay? You're going to have to deal with that issue sooner or later or when you feel the time is right maybe you are doing this for now because some situations in your life are not allowing you to move forward uh, maybe as fast as you would like to or with the um, conviction or the 100% resolving that you will like to this is making me feel like your hands are tied even though there are recognitions of some feelings not being there or missing something in the relationship, you cannot 100% move out of that, maybe because family, maybe because finances, maybe because some things that you might be asking you, or um, you are deciding, okay, yes, I have these feelings and issues, but right now is not the right time. Maybe because you are thinking that you have to be more strongly financially, um, ready but what I'm feeling okay from you as a recognition from the inside the inner okay this is kind of hard to explain because when when we are in a relationship okay and things happen things always begin from the inside out okay it's like sometimes you're like oh yeah I'm kind of not happy in this but and then sometimes it's different Sometimes it's that inner voice, the 100% comes out and tells you, I'm not happy in this anymore, it doesn't fulfill me, I don't feel the same love, I don't feel emotionally supported anymore. It's the recognition that things have changed, even though you might at times want to continue resolving in that relationship, the inner recognition and the inner soul search 
has already happened or is going to happen for many of you in the month of September. It's the acceptance, okay? It's the acceptance of, yes, I have to remove myself from this because it no longer serves me. This is not easy. This is very complicated. This can include, in, I mean, bring many emotions and um, feelings in many of you to to feel either sensitive, emotionally um, all over the place, or this can also be because family is not easy to deal with family when where when when there is a um, um, a separation or when you end something. Okay, why? Because you feel like okay, I'm gonna have to explain my mom, my mother-in-law, my brothers, uh, his brothers why this is happening and this is a, a is a period of time that i feel uh is difficult okay it's not easy for many many of you why because even though you have those feelings and you want to resolve or move out of that situation you feel like you can't either because of finances either because you're not ready or for this or whatever whatever you want to say okay whatever you want to um put in your mind that you need more time but the good thing, the only good thing that I see about this is the inner recognition, okay? It's the acceptance. Once the acceptance happening, little by little, you will get there and you will face whatever you need to face. Okay, so now, for some of you, I see um, you will be dealing with legal matters. This can be legal matters. They can be um, divorces, separations, court cases, um, dealing with situations that maybe something happened in the past and now it's time to resolve that issue um, I feel either you are going to feel like you are not being uh, treated fairly this can indicate the legal matter might not go your way and um, this situation can feel to you like okay why is this happening because I had, I have put all my efforts or your right intentions, okay? The, the right intentions or the, the willingness to resolve. But for some reason, I think this energy might be coming for, not exactly from you. There, this energy can be coming from your partner or with someone that you are going to be dealing with in the month of September. This can indicate, okay, you will have some arguments, misunderstandings. This can be with your partner, um, with a man, or someone that is going to say how things are going to be resolved, that uh, maybe is not understanding or having all the facts about the situation, but and this can be deal not in your favor. But maybe you are in perfect time to revise that, to get yourself um, get yourself informed about what is the best way to resolve this situation, okay? Or how can you turn around this situation? But definitely, the way I'm feeling this is that many of you, Taurus, are going to be dealing with a partner that is very dominating, wants to tell you what to do, when to do it, and how to do it, and either maybe in to some point force some ways to resolve a situation that you will disagree with, okay? And this can bring a lot of uh, um, words, exchange of words, miscommunication, or this can, this is feeling to me more like a situation that, um, You might have clarity about that, okay? Like when, like if you were asking and someone lied to you or not or betrayed you or this or that, I think that the final um, truth of what is fair, it will come out. But in the mix, while this is happening, I think it's going to be a lot of power struggles or a lot of back and forth before that can be resolved. Because what I see at the end of this, okay, you are dealing with a soulmate, um, a soulmate relationship, okay? This soulmate relationship can mean, well, maybe you have been with your partner for a long time, 
or maybe you have had this relationship um, for years and it's not easy to just break this relationship apart and continue life okay why because it's it's a lot of back and forth yes i love you yes yes no but um the question is going to be okay let's just put the put everything on the table let's be clear with each other and just tell me uh either um did you love me or not do you want to be in this relationship or not do you want to continue trying or not the answer of that is going to be up to you, to you to say what you really want to do okay first of all please the first the, the first thing i want to say for some of you because i see you already single this indicates to me okay your partner wants to come back and try again okay be uh, maybe one in a second opportunity this is also indicating to me that there you had already decided that, that something is no longer serving you or someone uh, is not making you happy you cannot lie to yourself about that but for some of you i see this different this can be someone else this can be someone else entering your life this is someone that maybe you have not expressed completely or openly what you feel or your love and the time is going to arrive in the month of september to come clear about that okay either did you love me or not did you want to initiate a relationship with me or not i see okay go ahead and express your love what you really feeling what you really uh, have inside you okay the time is here and now but if some of you made the mistake to lie to yourself in continuing resolving in the relationship that you are in then you're gonna have to come back and deal with this energy once and again maybe some other month if it's not next month if it's not in october it might be in um november or december but it's clear to me because uh, many of you i see the acceptance of i'm not happy there um if you take a step back then you will continue to to come back and deal with it so you are gonna have to decide do you love that person or not do you want to be with that person or not are you in or are you out so that is all i have for you taurus thank you so very much for allowing me to read for you as always if you would like to book a private reading with me in the description box you can find out how thank you don't forget to please like share and subscribe thank you i wish you all a wonderful day bye